what it's material today. I'm filming a Depop collective clothing haul because I say this stuff every single of my hauls, but I've been buying quite a few bits recently, so I thought I'd show you. But yeah, I basically I've been buying lots of stuff, so I thought I'd show you. Like majority of this is from Depop, but also a few of the bits are from Urban Outfitters, so I'll show you them as well. Um, but I'll start off with like the Depop stuff, and before. I start, my Depop is Goldie Fits, it's G-O-L-D-I-E-F-I-T-S, but I'll put it on the screen somewhere, um, or a link in the description. Now let's just get started, okay, yeah, I don't know where to start. Okay, so the first thing that I picked up is a jumper, it's from Burberry and it's beautiful, let me just tell you that. It's basically just this like beige colour, it's a zip up hoodie and it just says Burberry across the middle. The hood has like the Novacek inside and it's basically just like a really lovely hoodie. It has like the Novacek lining and the pockets have a bit of Nova on it. I love it. It's really quite beautiful. Um, yeah, this is from Depop. Well, it's a Depop also of course can be from Depop, but yeah. Love this. Woo. Yay. So the next item is a top which is from a um, an actual like clothing brand so it's not just like a person says like an actual brand so I'll put their name on the title or in the description and um, it's basically like a brand that like prints like graphic images onto tops and I got this white one with a picture of Travis Scott on because I really like his music and also I thought the picture was really cool yeah I just thought the picture was really cool and I imagined it going well with some cycling shorts that's why well, I bought it because I needed some more white graphic tops but also with blue trackies because he's wearing a blue like jumper so I thought colour coordination that was my thought process so yeah this is just size small just like a graphic top pretty much so the next thing are a pair of joggers which you might have seen in my pink lookbook if you haven't make sure to watch it these are some hot pink velour Juicy Couture trackies, which are beautiful. Um, they look like this. On the side they say, Glamorous Juicy Couture. Um, they're basically just hot pink, velour. If you want to see how I styled them, check out the lookbook. But they're basically just, yeah, that's kind of all there is to say about them. They're sort of like flared, sort of just flowy down, if that makes sense. Like they're not tight, they just flow down. He's a size medium, which I usually would go for a small, but they only had medium and they were like a tenner or something, so had to cop. Love them. The next thing I got you would have also seen in the pink lookbook, and that is the most beautiful. <sighs> so gorgeous. Yeah, it's basically just this Dior boob tube. Looks like this, if you can see. Um, it's basically just the Dior monogram print boob tube basically. I love it so much but I actually did spill some food on it which is not so good so she has to go in the wash but I had to save it for the haul but yeah it's basically just like a a dual boob tube I love. Wow she's so soft. She's really soft. Yeah this is gorgeous. I wanted one of these for ages and they have them in like different colours so I might have to buy some of them if I pluck up the money but yeah got her so the next thing I got is this top from Brandy Melville I got it off Depop though um, it's basically just this lilac crop top <laughs> hold up a lilac crop top um, it's just like a vest ribbed I thought it was a really nice colour I'm really liking lilac at the moment so so that was super cute and it's like a raw hem as if someone's just chopped it off and Bradley Melville is one size obviously which I don't agree with but it's in the size one size also while we're speaking of Brandy Melville I went into Brandy Melville in London the other day and I picked up the same top but in green it's like the exact same top but in like a really nice pale green and I don't know I thought it was a really interesting colour really quite liked it so I also picked this one up this was like £14 I think, or £12, I don't know, it was something like that, um, yeah, I really like it, I thought it was a really, really lovely colour, yeah, so, 
I then picked up a handbag because I have quite a few bags, quite a large collection. If you want to have a bag collection then let me know and I'll make sure to film it but I have quite a few bags. But I didn't have like a nice big handbag, like I have small little cute handbags and rucksacks but no like big handbag which I actually like. So I thought it was time to buy one. So I bought this FC UK uh, French Connection um, handbag and it's denim. It says FC UK on it, um, which I love. It basically is just like a pair of jeans. Like, look, it has like, it's literally like a pair of jeans. I just thought this was like so, so gorgeous. And it's like the perfect size. Do you know what I mean? It's nice. Had to purchase. So that's everything that I've picked up from Depop recently. But now we move on to the other stuff. So next I went to a charity shop like two days ago and I wasn't seeing anything like it wasn't very successful and I was like okay so in the children's section and I found the most gorgeous top um in the children's section age 12 but fits me like a glove it's basically just this purple gap top I know like gap is like a bit of a strange brand but I like it so what are you gonna do about it I thought this colour was so cool like it's a really nice purpley colour and then it just says gap in like a silver Diamante, rhinestones, whatever they're called. Um, I don't know, I thought it was really nice. And because it's age 12, it's like a little, no, it's not cropped, but like it kind of comes up a little bit short on me. So it looks really nice with like low weighted jeans, like my flared ones, my boot cut ones. <sighs> looks so good. So love her. Really do love her. Picked this bad boy up for £2. £2. I know. Next, I got this bra let bra crop top thing not too sure and um, which my best friend Orla kindly bought for me so hugs and kisses to you Orla love you lots she basically got me this electric blue is it a bra is it like a crop top thing I don't even know what it is yeah basically got this from Urban Outfitters and I've been wanting this for so long like I keep on oh it's gone a bit dark I've been wanting this for so long like I literally always see it in there and I just can't bring myself to buy it but luckily Orla purchased it what a queen love that girl Ooh, thanks Orla so next of all I picked up a skirt from Urban Outfitters which is really really something else I love her swaps oh my god I love it <laughs> it's this silk green leopard print long skirt I thought this was like really really interesting I never seen anything like it so had to buy and the end is like sort of frilled sort of not really I don't know um I don't know I just I love leopard print if you didn't really know that I literally own everything leopard print this was green leopard print and like silk and a long skirt I just thought it was just like so cool and I just had to buy so I did and no regrets and the last thing I got which is also a skirt from Urban Outfitters which is beautiful is this like cherub skirt um, I see this so, like, whenever I go to Urban Outfitters, I always see it, I always want to buy it, and I just never, I can never bring myself to uh, splash the cash, but I did, and no regrets. It's just so, like, dainty and cute, it's just, do you know what I mean? And, like, it has, like, this little frill at the top, and then the bottom is, like, sort of the lettuce, is it the cabbage or lettuce, whatever thing it is, like, where it's sort of frilled. I love her. Oh my god, stop seeing her. I love the skirt. And I mean, it's not very winter appropriate, but do I care? No. So, I got it. But yeah, that's everything that I've picked up over the past few, like, weeks, month. I don't know. Past few... Yeah, I'm just going to stop talking. Yeah, that's everything that I've bought. I really hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, comment down below any video suggestions which you want to see, all your opinions on the videos and make sure to subscribe and thank you so much for 700 subscribers. I have been getting quite a few subscribers recently so thank you to anyone who's joined. Um, welcome. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so awkward. Okay. That's all for the video. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.